Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is out of the blue corner. A kickboxer, holding a professional record, 10 wins. Colorado Springs, Colorado, USA, presenting Tornado Torres! A striker, holding a professional record, 14 wins, 2 wins. in Poland, presenting the number one ranked strong. Keith Peterson. Keith Peterson back at check. And T champion Neon J check in the all black. Torres is in red. She truly does get a star's reception. Yes. Whenever she won that fight, it was certainly a close fight, but Nami Yunus emerged with the unanimous decision. Was able to dictate the pace and the distance at which every. Looks like a land for Torres there on the inside. First three rounds. Both of these fighters with American top team roots. Tisha Torres. You really good job of driving forward pressure in the Joanna. And more importantly, hold her against the fence. So now Joanna is able to change that head position. She'll go. Torres talked a lot this week. And she gets reversed there in the clinch by Young Jacek, who has an underhook. You see Young Jake. She'll circle to escape to the right. Underhook. Now she's in a position where she can attack a single leg. Right takedown. The MJ check wisely. Punishment. Even though they're in this clinch position, the MJ check's trying to find place for her. To get anything accomplished. And she's opening herself up for knee to one leg instead of looking for doubles. And I know you can speak to just check in here for the first round, yeah. even if you lose the first round. Strike and moving. If you're Tisha Torres, you're okay here. Jacek yeah. right position where Joanna is still trying to score points. The Octagon. Yeah, Jacek's coaches talk a lot about her wrestling and grab. She's the one now with the head position. Jacek victim during her title reign. Under a minute now to go round one. She's not as powerful as I made her out to be. But she said that was a difference between. Against Andrade, she realized a little bit too late. She said, that way. But that allowed Torres to get in on a single here. Let's see if she can finish the job. Start circling backside, she can finish. Or she'll break in Jacek's posture. Jack, round one down. Stay with us. Shot. That's good. Her muscles were engaged the whole time. She's going to start slowing down now. Where did she move it back? A little bit more dirty. And then set. Aggression going forward with combination. Stepping to her. All right, she's moving. Let's go, got it. Okay. Tisha Torres, as this calm, poised individual, you may say the vision. Yeah, they want to get this fight to the ground. They want her to distract Joanna up high and in high. And Mike Brown happy with Young Jake. Yes, great, great thought by Mike Brown, but also Joanna and Jake is doing because in space, it's not going to be good for you fighting Joanna and Jake. Who will continue to work off of that jab while we're at distance? When you want something done, you do it yourself. So she's man not doing it until she gets her belt in, you know? Nice right, right hand window making championship weight when she didn't have to. Yeah. She's just having a, the jab very important, but also the footwork. She's never exactly where you expected her. Yeah, and Jacek starting to find her range a little bit here on the feet. Torres pressing. Given you wanted too much real estate. She's too square. When you're in front of your opponent and you can see the entire front, you see the whole chest, a single leg to try to secure your finish. Joanna's doing a real... Octagon trying to take her down up against the fence. There's an awfully big... Yeah. That's Fox UFC fight night. Alvarez versus Poirier 2. John Anik. <laughs> Maybe I try to go get a middleweight title. <laughs> ah, let's not. You can see the improvement in Joanna starting with the second level of her takedown. Right? The moment Tisha's on her as needs to start moving a little bit quicker in her takedown, finish it. Just over a minute to go in the round. Now Jacek has outlanded Torres 32. Gets the side of the octagon, but she hasn't been able to get her there in when she... I think that's fair. Right there is when Tisha needs to just explode and go. On the, along the side of the octagon is where you do it. You just let your hands go. Torres trying to duck that head and get inside. Whoa. Look, you see it. Look, she... Very interesting happenings. Back to Calgary after this. Deep breath, Jay. Deep breath. What's that? Oh, we're fighting? Yes. That was a close round, so we got to be careful, you know. But I... Okay. Listen, right. the jab is working perfectly. Commit to everything you're doing. Have fun. Okay? Be you. Hands. 
tiny tornado. Hey, okay. Let's go, guys. Oh, just focus on that take now. Jeez. Let your hands go. Right here, you see both of these women just start to... Yolani and Jacek causes the clinch. She goes and grabs, kind of lost control. Great advice from both corners. Yeah, and the advice from Jason. I mean, Tisha Torres, her style for a long time has been rooted in punches and bunches. A massive advantage. She's throwing the jab. She's throwing the front kick that she's known for. Wiser to do it here in the center of the octagon. Nice combination on the counter. To be in range to land your strikes. You know it's coming back. So maybe go. Right. Mouse over the right eyebrow of T. Torres more accurate, but again, Jacek not surprisingly the far. Pace of the fight is real high because her cardio always holds up. But now, Yolanda would kick them all with a big right hand by Jacek. The right hand lands. The I know this might seem crazy. Right, winning right. good fight. You know what I'm saying? Like, you now see that maybe she doesn't have. You see a lot of the damage on that lead leg of Tisha Torres starting to limp. She wants to go against the number one contender. Just about two minutes. The second round. They fought in the clinch in the first round. So she's in this fight being really tight with Joanna and Jacek. Joanna has been able to set a hard time winning this fight. As yet, she's been unable to do so. Yeah, she has. Because you never know how judges see no this doubt. portion of the fight. She's the one that this action is getting judged. Now Jacek. Keith Peterson stops the action. In the division in which they are all still chasing Rose Namajunas. Tisha's squaring up a little bit. She needs to be cut off a little bit. They use the side of the outcome as a barrier for defense. You got it? Go do something. Go and make a statement as this fight ends. Continuing to apply pressure with the knees in the clinch. UFC fight night continues live. Front bridge shot there. We are in Calgary, Alberta, Canada for Fox UFC. But they have turned out as usual tonight. All three judges score this contest 30 27. And still the number one UFC strawweight contender. You want enjoy that? Tisha can prepared very, very good for the fights, but it's only a sport. You are not the team. Appreciate it. Guys, it was a very important fight for me, and I cannot wait to roll to the top again. I'm the star. I arrived to Canada with tomorrow, but I cannot wait to enjoy some fun. But guys, thank you for every day. It was an honor. I was happy birthday. All the best to you. Guys, thank you for the in Poland. I will see you soon. I'm coming back home. Cattle Kubis, Mikey Brown, Daya Davis. The number so much, it's an honor. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it once more. Proud division, Yoani Unchecked gets it done tonight. It must. Knows her way around a microphone. Our move of the flight is sponsored by Metro PCS. An ability to fight everywhere. She was defending the clinch.